The worst thing about kids and iPads in cars is that they're looking down all the time. Get it up there, get it so their eyes are level. So how's that, lads? Yeah. She's good to go. The boys can press play. It's like watching a little movie theatre. Hey, boys, that'll be 10 bucks. Yeah. What are you watching? Ninjago. Ninjago. Do you want me yeah. to hook it up in here? We'll put it up here. Come on, we'll show everyone how to do it. All right. What I've done is I've rigged up um, a little bit of a iPad holder slash media center for the kids. And um, I'll show you around the car and the van. I've used a lot of their gear and in the boat as well. It's called Railblazer. So you'll see me GoPro here is mounted on one with a few attachments. And then I've got another one up here mounted on the roof console. And then I can just clip things in and out. So the good thing is I can pull that GoPro out of there and slap it into that mount, or I can put it on the one on the back of the van or under the van or in the boat. Um, it's really cool stuff, man, eh? So I'll show you more about that. But anyway, I'll get this little media center rigged up for the kids and I'll show you what it's like. The worst thing about kids and iPads in cars is that they're looking down all the time. And I think that's really bad for their neck and their posture and stuff. So get it up there, get it so their eyes are level. and. Uh, I think you'd be better off because when you're doing a lot of K's in the car, if they can all watch a movie, just one movie, so you've only got one lot of noise coming out, not three different movie noises like blasting your ears, uh, it's good for them, but it's good for us too. So, anyway, I'll show you how it is. So, this one here is the Railblazer, uh, I think it's called device mount or uh, tablet mount, something like that. You'll see this here, it's all fully adjustable, so it fits different sizes, and these little arms drop in and out as well, right? So I'll put them out. Really, can I have that, man? Yep. I'll let this all the way down. And then we put his iPad. I haven't done this for a while, so wait for it. Why is that so? Here we go. You've got it all mixed up. It even fits with the case and everything on it, which is good. How do we turn that off, Rue? Pause. And then if you watch this on the back, you can unlock this one. Sorry, I'm a Gumby. Um, close it up so it's nice and tight and then lock that and then push these ones shut so it holds the device nice and tight like that move it along in the center I'm making this look hard by the way it's really not that hard and then this here has got the, the mount on it and so you can put it up in the, the lock it's on a swivel as well Gumby. There we go, and then you just click this across and it's in. And all you have to do, because oh, I am a Gumby at the moment, <laughs> you adjust that up so it's at the right angle. That's the right angle. Like that, that's the right angle. And then look at this, you can move it um, that way. If the kids unlock, is that an unlock? Oh, there you go. You can lock this swivel. So if it's just one kid, you can move it that way or that way. Or well, Charlie's asleep, so I'll slightly tilt it towards the boys. How's that, lads? Yeah, great. And then just uh, lock. Which way? Lock that up. She's good to go. The boys can press play. It's like watching a little movie theater. So, happy days for the lads, eh? There you go, boys, that'll be 10 bucks. <laughs> what?